two. Welcome to day two. Uh, we're on our way to the expo arena Dad. to check out how the stand's being built, make sure the stock's put in. And uh, I don't even know what we're going for, actually, so you're probably the wrong person to ask. <laughs> Dan? We're going to set up all the stock. The stand's practically built. I'm just waiting for the stock to get there. We're going to go throw some boxes around. <laughs> um, just make a bit of a mess, really. Let everyone know we're here. The funny thing is, that's going to look like it was planned. <laughs> oh god. Did nobody wait? <laughs> Did nobody wait? <laughs> Did nobody oh, wait? Oh, oh, obviously well. not! Oh. Well, Dan knows that I'll meet you down in a second, so I was like, alright, cool. I got in the taxi thinking the taxis would be staggered. Obviously they weren't. Dead night is not here. I better give him a call. Oh. Mark just landed. Send him the, the address. Um, you can check in. The room's in his name. And then we'll be back in about three hours. Cool. And the room's in his name, yeah? <laughs> it's in his name. There he is, good boy. Literally a pig pen in here last year. Yeah. Tiny, yeah. tiny, half a size. Had the roof yeah, on it. Sweat fest. Great. But like, think about it. You got this. Is this. Bradley here. Two hour, three hour queue maybe for the three hours on stage. And you put Paige Hathaway here. It's the same thing. It's going to be absolutely well, magic. Unfortunately for any stands around us, because they're going to get our queues wrapped around them like a snake. Okay, so this is all the stuff um, shipped over from the warehouse back in Bromsgrove. Uh, it's time to get it all into the stand, get it all arranged, get it all set up, ready to sort of sell tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Doing good. Really happy, happy with the stand. It's it's different to last year. Last year we had the double deck. Um, we chose to remove that this year just because of restrictions of FIBO. You can only build so high. I mean. You've probably seen some, in some of the footage that you guys will see, the ceiling is really low. Uh, you can't put lights up, you can't have hanging banners, so having the deck seemed a bit pointless because the, the lighting up there wasn't very really good. A lot of the athletes and some of the fans didn't like the fact that the, the images weren't very really good. So we completely re removed that this year. We're only selling from one side, but the big graphic this side, the stands are going to white, very similar to what you saw in Australia. It's a bit new, which we're trying. Um, really happy with the stand, which is really, really good. The stock's here on time, the store is ready. I reckon we could be out in here in two hours, which is, will be a record. Because last year at FIBA we had a nightmare. Mark and Kath have just landed. So tomorrow, which is Thursday, next Mark and Kath on the stand. Friday, next Mark, Kath, Sophie Armbry. Saturday, next Mark, Kath, Sophie, Bradley, Paige, Alan, Sophia. And the time again for Sunday, Mark and Sophia. Ooh. Thoughts, good expo. Looks like there's a lot, a lot of bigger stands here. I think people, people seem to be spending more here than I've ever seen in our last three years here. Um, yeah, big, a big, big expo. Definitely the biggest in terms of floor space that I think we, we do at all. Um, looking forward to getting some food now because we're absolutely starving. <laughs> Done. Finish, and that's it. We're at all bar, all bar one now. Not again. I'm, not having all, I'm not having all this though. And I'm not having all like this. Dan's recording now. 
Difference is though. Take two, click. Yeah, the yeah, difference is you guys will be taking three, taking four, taking five. It comes natural to me now, really. Ready? We are all bar one now. Just have some food. Oh, yes. Yes. We are all bar one. I'm not having this. I ain't doing it. We are. We are at all bar one now. We've just had some club sandwiches, steak sandwiches, and sweet potato fries all around. Expo was set up in record time. All the athletes are here now, or they're arriving tomorrow, ready for the Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday FIBO Expo. We're going to chill out, grab a Starbucks coffee, coffee, not coffee, <laughs> and then go to the gym. I'll probably ruin the end of it. So tomorrow, it's going to be you, Lex, on the stand, easy day, trade day. So we'll do that. And then Friday, Sophie's coming as well. Sophie Armbring. You know, Mayor of you. Yeah, we need Mitchell, so we need the passes. Cool. And yeah. Saturday's when we get to visit. Yeah, We've got crazy. like Bradley Page, Alan, okay. Sophia, yeah. Sophie. Look, she will be massive. It's going to be crazy. <laughs> we need to smuggle Mark. We'll die on it. <laughs> no, to be honest, that's not that's not in post production. I tend to just shoot my white balance that way. I shoot quite blue. Do you know what I mean when I'm shooting? So, cool. oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. but like the, uh, with the FS7, you need to apply like a loot. Three or four. While you can have, yeah, while shooting. Yeah. And then, and then you know exactly. And then you get the log footage afterwards. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Back to the hotel. Yeah. Yeah. I think you can do the same thing with the S7R. That's the, uh, the thing I wanted to show. Yeah, I think so, so we're stood in the middle of the city centre. We are on our way to the fitness first to do some training because Mark and Kat have just arrived from Canada. We're going to go take them, show them the gym, get a workout in, and then we're going to go and explore what is apparently a windy city. <laughs> when Dan yeah, writes you an email telling you... And what about Lewis? Do you remember Mark's haircut bad, the original bad. FIBO? Dan. <laughs> Do you remember his haircut, the original Fibo, with like Bieber hair you, you coming down the over the ears? Now, the just, picture, yeah, yeah. picture of, of Mark then and now. You were such a nerd, man. It was so funny. Such when you look a nerd back. Case, man. <laughs> so the cathedral of Cologne was built in 1786, I believe, by, uh, I think it was the United States built this. And then they left it for the Germans as a present. It's absolutely spectacular. I think there's three statues on each three corners. It's shaped like a triangle. Each representing north, east, and south. West wasn't discovered then. So they only do us three points. Triangle. Excuse me, that's where the... Oh, this took a thing. Well, Rome wasn't built in the day, but I think this was actually what was built in the day. Oh. Which is, this is why it's so spectacular. And what was really good about it, they decided to build it next to McDonald's, Starbucks. It's just so good for the tourism. And we're going to go inside now, we'll see what it's like. <laughs> that was so funny! No. So yeah, we've um, all come back. Pretty yeah, chill day and now we're that. heading to get some food at Noodle House. Yeah. Um, we're actually missing Mark and... They're going to come up the we got, we've, got an, we've got an Ollie Smith <laughs> running <laughs> to catch up. So yeah, going to go have some nice food, chill out and um, prepare for tomorrow, the first day of FIBO. Come on! Hi. The Gymshark All Access. So yeah, Hannah's one of the uh, Scandinavian models. Uh, and athlete and works with uh, Chris Johan and Vladimir in the Norway, Sweden and Danish sort of territories. So she'll be with us on the stand this week. Say hi. Pretty much sums it up. Hi. <laughs> They're all trying to have that little big boys. Oh, let's all order that, Lex. Let's all order that, Lex. Yeah, Lex all you. Food all comes. Everyone's ready for it. Mitch finishes. I'm finished. Let's have a look at that. <laughs> It looks good. What's this, Dan? Explain yourself. Explain that to expensive camp. That's, that's Turk, turkey breast. Talk to parents. Tell parents you're sorry. <laughs> sorry, watch the food parents. And, and, and there's still the pizza. And there's still the pizza. That thing started that. Poor form. Yeah, well, we're trying to upload uh, the day one of the All Access Week. Obviously, Germany is still living in 1988, so it's pretty much impossible to get into that connection faster than a video. How are you, bro? Good to see you, alright? See you, mate. You're alright. Good to see you. Looking swish. Looking big. Looking swish. Oh, you're small. Yeah, so am I. Just a little bit going now. I didn't feel like fretting this time, man. So it's the end of day two here in Germany. Um, we've just finished setting up all of the stand today. Um, the guys done an amazing job. Mitch got everything organised really, really well. Um, all the guys sort of mucked in and getting everything sorted out. You might have seen a few laughs along the way. Um, you know, we've had we've had some fun. Obviously, you know, we're here to enjoy ourselves as well as working really, really hard. 
um, you know, this is the part where we can all come and enjoy ourselves at the end of the day as well. You know, we don't we don't put in all that work, you know, throughout the year just to make it seem like, you know, that it's all it's all really serious. It's all about the business. You know, you guys see that we have a lot of fun in what we do. Um, so, you know, this is where we get to really sort of practice what we preach in, in that sense and being sort of, you know, being a visionary in that whole sort of gym shop mentality. Um, so, yeah, tomorrow is officially the start of day one. Um, I think you'll really see a big shift in in our sort of attitudes the way towards everything you know all of you will will be you'll see our customers you'll see the guys that will come and talk to us about trade relationships all of the sort of you know the the, the stuff that really drives us as a business um, which already kicks off tomorrow so um, really excited to get kicked off um, everyone's feeling really good really positive we're gonna have an early night tonight um, get some sleep and early start tomorrow which uh, which we're all really looking forward to yep stay tuned